Hello greetings, welcome to another one. So Prophet Jubed Angel he has raised his biological son, uh, Prophet Jubed Angel Jr. You can actually see him ministering his uh, a powerful young minister of the gospel. So let's listen to what he's going to be saying about a moment where he was going through some turbulent times and he wanted his father's advice. One day, you see, it's very hard for me to talk to my father about problems. Let me tell you this. One day I complained about something that was going on in my life. And I said, Papa, I need some advice on this. Those times I said, let me speak to him as a father. I need some advice on this. Do you know what the man replied? He sent me his video. Now, sit down true story I just saw a video link I said what type of father is this maybe I should delete his number or something a video link why because the same thing he would tell me is found in the messages he preaches when you are a man of cloth men of the cloth there is something that we call conditioning of the spirits. Your spirit must be seasoned in and out of season. You must be ready. A seasoning. You don't just become a man of growth because you heard a message and get excited. It takes constant hours in the word of God. Constant hours in the word of God. Sit down. I thought he would tell me a new revelation. He sent me his video. What type of father is this? What type of man is this? The same power that is in his word is here now. We don't need to wait for him to talk. The same atmosphere is here now. Sit down. Ah, when I come on here, I know it's by God. You see, men of the cloth are men of his presence. There are certain people that say on that day we were in the presence of God but when it comes to men of cloth they are shocked when they step out of the presence the story got you laughing right but at the same time it's a very powerful story so thank you for sharing this with me to share with the audience thank you so much for watching the video like share comment and subscribe and I'll meet you in another one God bless you